So today I am preserving my sister's wedding bouquet flowers. The quicker you can start preserving them, the better the flowers will turn out. Pull out each individual stem from the bouquet. Next, you're going to want to pull out your silica gel. It's almost like a white sand, so be careful because it can get messy pretty fast. Using a small bin, start by adding one layer of the silica gel. Now you can start adding some flowers. For this first layer, I would suggest starting with your bigger flowers, so your roses, anything that's large. And just as a small disclaimer, the silica gel does come with instructions. I do go off of these a little bit, but I still have great results, which is what I'm showing you today. Once it's full, go ahead and add another layer of silica gel to completely cover the flowers. And also, just as a side note, I ended up purchasing two bags of silica gel, which was enough to preserve maybe like half of the bouquet. So really how much you need just depends on how many flowers you want to preserve. For this next layer, I usually try and add some flat greenery to just try and squeeze some more in there. The silica gel does come with this guide, it's super awesome, and it tells you how many days your flowers need to be in the silica gel, depending on what they are. I waited a total of three days before taking out all of my flowers. My favorite thing about silica gel is how well it keeps the color of the original flower. And here they all are after being preserved. Can't wait to use these in some future projects. Thanks for watching and go ahead and click that subscribe button for more.